Welcome back 543 now. If you've ever suspected that some reviews on Amazon were fake, turns out your hunch may have been correct. Consumer reporter John Matteries tells us this morning about some new findings about those reviews so you don't waste your money. Do you read Amazon reviews before you purchase a product? Well, a new report claims many of those reviews may have been paid for by the seller. Whether shopping Amazon or Walmart, many of us, like Missy Verdon, read reviews first. Depending on the product, if I don't know the product, I always re read the reviews, and that determines what I buy. But more and more shoppers, like Katie Maddock, have their suspicions. Do you trust those online reviews? Not always. Demetrius Kasem doesn't. You know, one person could say one thing, then you can go in there and you can find something totally different. Now, I just ordered a video cable from Amazon. Came in a few days, great price and great reviews. But how do I know I can trust those reviews? A a new report in PC Mag says in many cases you can't. It says a recent data breach exposed 200,000 Amazon reviewers who are allegedly paid for glowing reviews. They were sent the product, they were given instructions about how to review, including like make it look very believable, obviously make it positive. PC Mag's Chandra Steele tells me that third party sellers would then reward the reviewers. We'll let you keep that product for free. We will pay you for the review. Amazon has released a statement saying we have clear review policies and we ban and take legal action against those who violate those policies. But PC Mag says look for verified purchaser reviews, read both the best and worst reviews, and look for common complaints in the worst reviews. Why would a seller pay for fake reviews? To boost their position on Amazon, so their product shows up first. As always, don't waste your money. I'm John Matteries, 23 ABC.